What options are you considering, Mr. President, if it does end up being a long-range missile test? We'll see what happens. I think we'll see what happens. Well, let's see. Maybe it's a nice present. Maybe it's a present where he sends me a beautiful vase as opposed to a missile test, right? I may get a vase. I may get a nice present from him. You don't know. You never know. I don't think a lot of folks are thinking it's either a vase or one of the beautiful letters uh, from Kim Jong-un. Having said that, is a, a, a long-range missile test the only option, even if it's the most likely option? Uh, no, it's not the only option. Uh, they could demonstrate uh, a ballistic missile capability from the sea. They've done that once or twice already. Uh, they could demonstrate a capability to use solid fuel propellant. All of these things would show that North Korea has made step increases in their capability um, and moved in the direction of having a survivable nuclear weapons force, which means one that the United States cannot easily take out through military action. So, you know, these are very serious. At the same time, though, you know, this is pressure on Trump to release some of the sanctions. That's what the North Koreans wanted last February when the two leaders met in Hanoi.